celebrating his success with his three-year-old son Emil and other family and supporters. Aaron Hawkins is now Dunedin's mayor and he says he's pleasantly surprised by the result. Speechlessness isn't something that afflicts me often. Um, I wasn't, wouldn't say I was confident. Uh, I was optimistic that the city would get a good outcome without being confident that I would be uh, the successful candidate. With three-term Mayor Dave Cull standing down, 14 hopefuls had stood for Mayor in a campaign marred with vitriol and accusations. Hawkins secured about 16,500 votes, which saw him squeaking in with a margin of just 14% over his nearest rival, Lee Vandivis. A lot of time, volunteer time, went into making this happen because you know, we didn't have a lot of money to spend on advertising. It took human effort to get out and have conversations with people and talk to our community about what their priorities were. And you know, The mood in the community I think was largely positive um, and we ran a positive campaign and, and I think that's been reflected in the result, um, not just for the mayoralty but also for the city council election. The Green Party candidate and former city councillor says he's taking over the helm at a busy time for the city, with the hospital build and central city upgrade looming as major projects in the city. I think it was an incredibly important election uh, for the, the future of the city. There's a lot going on. Um, it's, it's an exciting time in Dunedin but also a very challenging time and I think given uh, the significance of some of the major projects and some of the challenges that we have, uh, it was important that we had strong and progressive political leadership to build on the momentum that we've built over the last two terms. Elsewhere in the region all current mayors were re-elected, including Jim Bolt in Queenstown, Tim Shadbolt for Invercargill, Gary Tong in Southland and Tim Cadogan in central Otago. We'll bring you interviews with these re-elected mayors in tomorrow's bulletin. In Dunedin, the South Today.